Eva, what kind of unit are those ocelots I fought a little while ago? The Ocelot Unit is an elite group composed of soldiers handpicked from among the ranks of Spetsnaz, the Special Forces Wing of Gru. They've undergone even more rigorous training than regular Spetsnaz. Their skill with weapons is the stuff of legends. You'll find they're much better shots than the rest of Gru. Watch yourself. Tell me something, Snake. Why did you let Ocelot get away? I thought I told you already. Because he's still a kid? Yeah. <laughs> Pretty lame excuse, if you ask me. You think so? Yeah, I do. Maybe you're right. Eva, I wanted to ask you about Ocelot. Yeah, I know. He's pretty infatuated with you, isn't he? That's not what I meant. Aren't the Ocelots an elite unit? Yeah. So how'd he get to be their commander? He can't be any older than 18 or 19. I can't believe he's already a major. I heard from the colonel that he's been given special treatment. Special treatment? Yeah. He's the son of some legendary hero or something. Mm, no wonder he seems to have the right stuff. So who is this legendary hero anyway? Beats me. Mm -hmm. The colonel never told me. All I heard was that his mother was supposedly shot in the gut during battle, and that he was born right there with bullets whizzing past them. A pregnant woman in the middle of a battle? That's what I heard. They say that when they stitched her up, the scar was shaped like a snake. Well, that's battlefield medicine for you. What about his father, this legendary hero? He didn't tell me. I don't think Ocelot's ever met his parents. Are they dead? Maybe. I don't know. There were a lot of MIAs back then, during the last days of the war. Ocelot probably would have ended up the same way. But he was taken in and raised by Gru and Volgan. Because he was special. That's my guess. Eva, what happened to Ocelot? <laughs> Can't get enough of him, huh? He doesn't trust you. I know. So it's me you're worried about then. Eva. I'm fine. I know how to handle him. Besides, I think he's got his mind set on someone else right about now. What? Figure it out. Eva, about the contents of the backpack you got for me. Is there something missing? Yeah, all of my food. Well, how strange. You didn't. It wasn't me. Huh. All those snakes and crocodiles and suspicious-looking mushrooms, I wouldn't eat that stuff even if you paid me. What about the instant noodles? Mm. Eva? I was hungry, okay? Give me a break. It's just a little packet of noodles. It wasn't just the noodles, all those animals I worked so hard to capture. That wasn't me. So who was it? It was Ocelot. Ocelot? He said he wanted to eat the same things you did. Why would he do that? You haven't figured it out? No. You are dense. <sighs> Eva, where are you now? I told you, didn't I? I'm right near the colonel. Pretty weak answer, if you ask me. I suppose you're right. Eva. Snake, I'm under orders to cooperate with you, but that doesn't mean I have to tell you everything I know. I would assume the same applies to you, too. Mm. Snake, be careful. I might not have told you this yet, but that swamp is rigged with traps. Tell me about it. <laughs> so you know already? Yeah. Well, then you're all set. The traps in that area are set to go off when a rope stretched along the ground is disturbed. Keep a close eye on the ground and make sure you don't trip over a rope. I mean, far be it from me to call you an idiot who can't avoid even the simplest of traps, but you know... <clears throat> what's the matter? Nothing. Never mind. Uh -huh. Eva. What? I couldn't get a hold of you for a while there. What were you doing? What do you think I was doing? That's what I'm asking you. Why are you asking me that? Because I want to know, that's why. Want to know what? Will you stop answering my questions with questions? Are you mad? <sighs> See ya. Eva. Yes? Who is that Tatiana? <laughs> Taken a liking to her, have we? Mm. Yeah, she's a cutie. Who is she? I don't know that much about her, but from what I can tell, she seems to be Sokolov's lover. 
Can you find out a little more? Snake. She already has a man. Eva. All right. Just give me a minute. Snake, I found out what I could about your Tanya. Just as I thought, she's apparently Sokolov's lover. When Sokolov was taken away from his research facility, she was taken along with him. So she's been with him since he was at the research facility? Mm, that's what it looks like. Are you sure about that? Yes. Why? The Major said Sokolov wasn't the kind of guy who'd take a lover. Mm, maybe he was lonely, being away from his family for so long. And whatever else he is, Sokolov's still a man. It's only natural he'd be attracted to her. Only natural? She's irresistible. Gorgeous in a girl-next-door kind of way. Nice proportions, too. Hmm. Sounds like your type, huh? Eva. Gotta go. Eva, how are things on your end? Are you going to be able to make it? I'm fine. I managed to slip out okay, though I did run into a few snags. Is there a problem? I took a little detour on my way here. Detour? Yeah, I thought since you went to all this trouble to meet me, I should give you a present. A present? What is it? You really want to know? Yeah. It's a secret. <sighs> You'll find out when you get here. The security in the West Wing where Sokolov is being held is extremely tight. The only ones who are cleared to enter the West Wing are those with Colonel Class authorization. One of those people is Major Rykov. To get into the West Wing, you could disguise yourself as Rykov. First, you'll have to take Rykov out and steal his uniform. He's in the East Wing of the Weapons Lab in the center of Groznygrad. All right, but why? Huh? Why do I have to steal Rykov's clothes from him? What about that scientist outfit? That's not going to work this time around. Rykov's uniform is a special type that only he wears. You'll have to get it directly from him. Normally, I'm pretty good at getting men to take off their clothes, but it won't work on him. Huh? You, on the other hand, might have a better chance with him. What's that supposed to mean? What indeed? Anyway, the only way to get Rykov's uniform is to take him out and steal it yourself. He's somewhere in the East Wing. Eva, about this Major Rykov. Yes? You said he had Colonel Class authorization, right? Right. But his rank is Major, so how can he have Colonel Class authorization? Rykov is treated as an officer of equal rank with Colonel Volgin. Treated as the same rank? Yeah. Even though he's a major. Right. Why? You don't know? No. Even after seeing that photo? Nope. Has anyone ever told you you're a bit slow? What are you talking about? I'll leave you to think about it. Wait a minute. Gotta go. Eva, I disguised myself as Rykov. Hmm. What's wrong? Something's not quite right. Not right? Hmm. What? What is it? Hmm. I got it. Your face is all wrong. Let's say what now? I mean, your face isn't his. Well, I would hope not. Well, you need to do something about that. Do what? Well, you're a smart guy. You figure it out. Okay. Your Rykov disguise is complete. Now they won't stop you no matter what you do. Even if I punch someone in the face? Right. Really? Really. Why? Rykov's just that kind of guy. Uh, Eva, what kind of guy is Rykov? He's Volgan's precious pet. Anything else? He's got a handsome face. Is that what you really think? No, I'm just being objective. I'm not interested in people who aren't interested in me. I was hoping to get some useful info for becoming him. Hmm, he seems mild-mannered, but the kind of guy who would sit in his room and admire his bug collection. That still doesn't help me much. Anything more? I really don't know, Snake. Uh, can't you just observe him and copy him yourself? Why are you so evasive about this? <sighs> People like me don't even exist in his little world. I see. Okay, then. Did he dump you? I see, huh? You don't get it at all. No, not that. 
I'm just not good with his type. But... If this conversation goes on any longer, I'm going to send my fist through this radio into your head. Figure him out yourself. Later. <sighs> Snake? Eva, do they drug the prisoners here with hallucinogens? I don't think that's their style. Why? I had a pretty bad dream. A dream? This monster that I'd never seen before was coming at me with a knife. And I wasn't me, I was something else. That doesn't surprise me. You're in a mild state of shock from all the pain and exhaustion you're going through. Ah. Maybe one day you'll learn to stop hiding yourself. What do you mean? I know how you feel, Snake. I'm a spy too. You don't realize it, but the fake you is eating away at the real you. The person you're pretending to be is becoming the person you are. And the real you is screaming out from somewhere deep inside. That's what you saw in your dream. Maybe so. I'd sing you a lullaby or something, but unfortunately I don't know any. So pick your favorite song, and I'll sing it for you in your head. Any song? And you can have as many encores as you want. Sounds fun. <laughs> it's a deal, then. I'm sure you'll find a way to escape. Good luck. Thanks. By the way, Snake. What? Why aren't you eating it? Huh? What are you talking about? The instant noodles. Why aren't you eating them? Do I have to? Of course you do. Why? <laughs> because it's a present for me. Um... You probably didn't know, but instant noodles are really popular among the troops here at Groznygrad. It was really hard to get my hands on some, and I even managed to get three whole packages of it. Three? But you only gave me two. Uh, anyway, that's not the point. The point is, you'd better eat it, or else. Eva, you didn't lose any of my equipment, did you? Why? Don't you trust me? It's not that, it's just... Don't fret. I haven't thrown anything away. Not even that fine piece of literature. Uh... Honestly, in the middle of a mission? I... That's... I know. Jeez. All you had to do was tell me and it would have helped you out. What? Distracting the enemy. Oh. Oh. Hmm. Eva, didn't you take a picture of me when I was about to leave the waterfall cave? Oh, that. That's a button-shaped hidden camera developed by the KGB. I use it to take pictures of the fortress and the Shagahad and... That's not what I wanted to know. Why did you take a picture of me? Because I wanted a picture of you. <sighs> if I told you why, would you believe me anyway? <sighs> By the way, Snake, do you have a calorie mate? Yeah. Is it any good? Yeah. Oh. You want it? What? Do you want the calorie mate? What? What are you saying? You want it, don't you? Well, I didn't say that. So you don't want it, then? No. But if you were going to give it to me as a token of thanks for me helping you out, then of course I wouldn't refuse it. Are you on a diet? What did you say? Calorie made is supposed to be really good for losing weight. <laughs> Are you saying I'm fat? No. I'm not on a diet, and I don't need one. I, I just wanted to try the taste. Oh, sorry. Be careful with what you say. Yeah, sorry. So, is it true? Is what true? That it's good for losing weight. Yeah. Calorie Mate provides a nutritionally balanced source of energy, and it makes counting calories easy. That's what's supposed to make it good for dieting. Oh, I see. I heard that all of the geisha in Japan use it. Geisha? Yeah. I've never heard about that. Really? Yes. I'm sure there are some geisha out there using calorie mate for diets, but I doubt all of them are using it. Uh, I guess not. Eva, about this explosive. The C3? Yeah. Wasn't this stuff developed in the States? That's right. So where did you get it? There's a vault full of Western weapons used for research purposes. And you stole it from there? Yep. How? 
A vault full of secret Western technology should be under strict surveillance. You really want to know? Yeah. Really? Yes. Well, I'm not telling anyway. Why not? It'd be a waste of time. A waste of time? Even if I explained how I did it, you'd never be able to do it yourself. What does that mean? Exactly what it sounds like. Eva, that Shagahod data you got from Sokolov. Uh-huh. Are you really going to give it to Khrushchev? You think I'm going to answer that? I know I want you to answer me. You're asking me for something I can't give you. Uh... Snake, I have a mission to carry out just like you. Please, try to understand. Mission. Snake, I wanted to ask you something. What? In the torture room? Why did you protect me when Ocelot was about to fire? Because I knew that the chamber wasn't empty, and you'd be dead if he pulled the trigger. But your eye... I was tied up, and it happened so fast. It was the best I could do. I feel a little strange, but it won't interfere with the mission. What about me? Huh? Did you only save me because I was important for completing your mission? What other reason would there be? And when the mission is over? Right now, it's just the mission. The mission you used to love? That's not what I mean. Eva. Hmm? You said you got along with the boss, right? Yeah, we get along pretty well. I admire her. Although she's supposed to be the distant hero, for some reason she's nice to me. She even carried my bags for me the other day. <laughs> I was impressed. Your bags? Maybe because we're both defectors. We never talk much, but I get the feeling that she understands how I feel. I've had dreams about the whole thing. Snake, the enemy's attack dogs are very highly trained, so be careful. You can tell if a dog's been highly trained or not? I can tell. How? I used to have a dog. You had a dog. <laughs> yeah. What's so funny about it? Nothing. It's just hard to picture you with a puppy. Who asked you? He was really cute, but I had a hard time housebreaking him. When he finally did learn, I was so happy. I still dream about it sometimes. Snake? Eva, what do you think? <laughs> what a dork. You must be kidding me. Are you willing to risk your life for that joke? All right, finally I get a normal response. What? Everyone was giving me strange responses and acting like nothing was odd about it. I was starting to wonder myself, but now I feel better. I'm not sure what you're talking about, but you look adorable in it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I gotta go. <laughs> this is too much. All right. Snake, don't forget about our dinner. I haven't forgotten. Sushi, right? I want to try the Otten Frog. The what? The Otten Frog. Frog? They have frog at sushi bars, don't they? Of course not. But I heard they eat frogs as sashimi and tempura over in Japan. Who told you that? Paramedic. I suppose they might eat frogs on certain occasions, but not normally. And certainly not as sushi. Oh. Okay. Eva, that was some pretty nice driving. <laughs> really? Ballsy, yet overwhelmingly accurate. That kind of driving isn't something you can pick up in a couple of days. I told you to trust me. I love motorcycles. It is not easy to jackknife a bike like that. So, you believe me now? Think I'll pass on going tandem, though. Oh, that's too bad.